Okay, so now I'm start. I'm going to start trimming my copings or my uh, implants. But for, for now, let me just fill it in the underneath of the uh, implants. Uh, just making sure that I covered the uh, the voids, the tissue areas of the uh, of the implants. I'm washing it up now. Um, let me just like uh, shape it a little bit with my knife, you know, so I can put in and out without interference. So that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to <clears throat> make sure when I put in and out will not going to get stuck to the uh, to the cylinder or to the to the implant uh, lab fixtures so I'm trying to clean it okay now I'm going to start uh, filling in okay now okay let me try to put it back I'll make sure so I can take in and out now I'm taking out the uh, the gingival moulage because I already have the ideas of, or the idea of uh, where I'm gonna terminate my, uh, my wax on the gingival area. So now I try it in, make sure it's, you know, I can take in and out and make sure that I have a good contacts, good contacts for my, uh, my implants, okay? So now I can, fill it in the voids you know like from the, the the end part of that metal that implant to all the way to the voids going up on a proximal make sure I fill it in and when I fill it in I will put it back to the cast making sure I'll have a a very good contacts in between okay so making sure that I have um, I don't have no voids or I don't have no gap for my wax and my metal fixtures all right so that's I will go into making sure that you know I fill it in no voids everything is intact to the wax all right okay now if this is a good a uh, gold uh, retained implant it is almost done but again like what I said this is for uh, I just did this for uh, for the copings all right wait okay here you go oh now I'm um, I'm um, trimming, trimming my wax, trimming my wax to the, to the surface, all right, taking out my uh, gingival, again, I tried it in, to make sure that I, it'll fit, okay, trying to put it back, making sure, there you go, so I can see the clearance, the good thing about Full, con full, full wax up you can see your reduction you can eyeball your, your reduction to how much you're gonna have space for your restorations for the Emacs so right now what I'm trying to do is trying to shape that like a prep like a prep tube like a prep tube without undercuts especially because it's going to be a metal I'm going to cast this to a metal it's going to be an implant uh, custom retained so I need to make sure that there's no undercuts make sure everything's smooth everything is convex especially on the uh, tissue area tissue area is very important that it's always convex you don't want to do it concave because it's, you need to make sure that it will fit snugly to the gums, to the implant uh, uh, areas of the gums. Make sure it's nice and tight. You don't want to make it loose, so you don't want to get like food 
and patches in there. You need to make sure that it will, when you tighten it, the, the implant, it will snug into the gums, to the gum areas, all right? So I'm trying to take out the lingual, trying to do a lingual reduction. Now I put it back into my uh, implant holder so I can see it better. Now I know where I'm going to put my design, the end, the margin of my uh, copings. There we go. All right, I'm using my hauling back uh, carver. Okay, now I'm using my burr. It's a straight burr that I use so I don't create no undercuts. I use this for the wax and I also use this for the metal. Like just to make sure that I have a straight, so I will have a straight uh, uh, surface. I have a straight surface making sure that I don't, I don't cut no undercut, all right? So it's better if you have, if you're warm, if you have a uh, plane that you can warm, warm your um, your um, burr, so it will be cleaner. All right, now I'm using the red uh, stripe. I'm just using the end of the, uh, of the, the round end of the, uh, the burr, so I will have a very good, uh, a good size of uh, margin on my implant. So I'll be, I need to make it sharp, like a sharp, a uh, clean cut for the margin so so I'm trying to do I'm trying to have a very nice um, light <clears throat> so it's going to be rounded now this is the product the done product all right this is it I have two implants I have three implants by the way but I'm just like showing these two okay making sure that I have it. Good to go. All right. God bless you all. Thank you for watching.